to get it done right, you know? It wasn't a super rush. Um, I think that was terrible. You can edit this, right? Ask me that question again. My name is Richard Oyola. I'm a ready mix driver for Sylvie Concrete. I work at a Logan plant. I've been doing this for about like eight years now. So I've been at this plant since the beginning, since it pretty much opened up in 2015. Starting out, it was kind of hectic at first, but I think I had the upper hand in learning to pour concrete because I've driven lots of trucks before I started here. But in terms of my progression, from where I am now, there's not a job I think I can get sent to where I couldn't get my load off. From a state load to a warehouse to a curb, I can get them all done. So the day-to-day -day schedule, uh, when you first come in, you know, we usually pull up to the trucks, start it up, get it ready, make sure all your lights are working, make sure you got no air leaks. That's first and foremost. Always gotta check your truck every morning because if your truck ain't right, you ain't getting loaded. So from there, we gotta grab our water. Uh, gotta fill up the water tanks every morning. When we're all ready to go, we hit that in-service button, and that means you're ready to pull under. Pull under the plant, get loaded, pull around back, rinse down, then get ready to go. Being a ready mix driver, 30% of it is actually driving, 70% of it is actually pouring concrete safely and correctly, because you have a lot of stuff in your surroundings from in front of you, behind you, and most of the time you're always pouring concrete in reverse. So you have to always be aware of your surroundings, you know, how fast you got the concrete coming out, then um, putting it where they want it. We were doing a big mash pour in the city. I, I wanna say it was the W Hotel. Pretty much the city was blocked off just for us to come in and out, in and out. And it felt like ready mix trucks took over the city for a night. I don't wanna say it like it's a racetrack where we were speeding around, but man, it was something to see out there. It feels pretty good, you know, that we have a piece of, of a building going up that's coming from us. You see the progression. When you build the warehouse, you can see it from start to finish. You know, you see progress. I can deliver concrete to the city and see the skyscraper at the end of the job. So working for Sylvie, um, it's a good company. They keep you working, keep you busy. Buildings going up, houses going up, the sidewalks you step on. The stuff you buy out of Amazon, all these buildings are going up. That job isn't going nowhere anytime soon. Us here, we got a really good core group of guys that have been here for a while. And when you have that, everybody kind of follows suit. And there's some funny stuff that happens on job sites. You know what I mean? You just laugh about it, talk about it. But everybody's here to help out one another. And we got a good group of guys here. So I really can't speak on other plants, but we got an A-team here.